Hey everybody, I need welcome to say back. Real quick. What? <laughs> Just interrupt me, why don't you? Welcome back to more Resident Evil Excuse 4. Me. One of the greatest games of all time. It's a pretty good game. It's really good game. It's a really good game. Man, what is that up there? Is that like a light? A lantern? Yeah. You um, that. We were talking about last time what we believe each of our favorite games of all time are. I had to answer calls for him, basically. No. Um, just had to not be such a butt. But he knew it. He he didn't know it. Like, I mean, Persona Five is close to Persona Three. Honestly, it's probably my fourth favorite. One of my, f it's my favorite games. Other than that, the only reason Five isn't my favorite, I haven't beaten that one yet. I haven't beaten it. I haven't gotten to the end, so I don't know the full gameplay. I've beaten Three twice, so. Um. So yeah. And I don't like FES because it's just. You don't. You can't really? control your party members at all. And it's more fun to play them. Anyway, another, but one thing I wanted to talk about was yeah. my love for Metal Gear Solid 2, yeah. which is my favorite game of all time. Wow. That's a bold statement. Hey, Stranger! Got something that might interest you. Got some new items on sale, Stranger. What a selection of good things. Did you know? I know. What I hadn't gotten to the place yet. Ah. Get the treasure map. I don't need it. It's a waste of ammo. What, well, a waste of ammo? <laughs> yeah, it's a waste. <laughs> Just shooting it out of his jacket. God dang it. Give me something good, man. What are you buying? Did you buy the TMP? No. Oh. It just shows me. Oh, okay. Um, but Metal Gear Solid 2, the reason why it's my favorite game, because it was the first game in the series that I ever played. Um... Because after we get done with this, we're going to do a small, Ooh. short two episodes, or one episode, of Metal Gear Solid 2 Skateboarding. Ugh. I want you to experience it. It's a lot of fun. Um, what about Ape Skate? Yeah, I know. We've already tried that, and it didn't work out. It's a thing, though. Yeah, we'll play it later down the line. Um, Metal no, Gear Ape Solid Escape and Metal Gear Solid. Oh, yeah. Well, I don't have three on me. Well, that's a shame. I had two in my PS2, and that's the only reason I have it with me. Um, but two Whoa. is my favorite game because it was the first game that introduced me to the series. Whoa. Uh And you know I love Metal Gear Solid. I started collecting the games. Like I have sixteen of sixteen Metal Gear games. Uh -huh. um, what? Uh, some of them are re-releases, and two of them were the exact same thing, mm. which is just Ground Zeroes. I just got another copy for Christmas. Um, whenever I get Phantom Pain, I might actually give you Ground Zeroes. I'm gonna get you a copy of Phantom Pain, probably. I don't yeah. care Bro about Ground Zeroes. Phantom Pain would be cool. Ground? Have you played Ground Zeroes? Yes. It's cool. It's really cool. Yeah, but it's one single place. Yeah, but you get Hideo Kojima. <laughs> I've done that. I've seen that. But you I get him, it and it's worth it. I don't care. Oh my god, lady. <laughs> just, just swinging. Um... But Metal Gear Solid 2. Oops. It's not the best game in the series, by any means. Metal Gear Solid 3 is yep. definitely the best game in the series. Yep. Without a doubt. I love Metal Gear Solid 3. Yep. Except for the freaking Fury boss fight. <laughs> like, it can be tough. Yep. But, um... It's just... 2 was the first game to show me that kind of variety and fourth wall breaking in any video game I've ever played. Oh, you played that one first? Yeah, that was the first Metal Gear game I ever played. Oh, I man. watched you play one a little bit, and I wasn't intrigued by it. But then Jake, Jake told me, your brother you Jake told me to play two. And I was like, okay. You don't even know about one, man. And that was the first stealth game I ever played, honestly. Mm -hmm. And I loved it. I, I just remember, I skipped school twice. I left school early, like twice. I, I left like before seventh period. Just to go home and play Metal Gear Solid 2. What a rascal. I've beaten 2. Mm, six times? I believe. And I'm probably gonna play it more. Probably gonna. I'm probably gonna play it when we get done recording tonight. We're just gonna hang out and I'll play Metal Gear Solid 2. You watch me play. No, man. Nah, I'm just kidding. We're probably gonna be playing the Halo story mode. 
something like that. We're finishing Stubbs the zombie. Mm. Yeah. We were gonna play Stubbs the zombie on the channel, but not really. I mean, I know it's Halloween. It's uh, October, not Halloween. Dude, this is Halloween, man. <laughs> Zombies. Halloween. Zombies, you kidding me? Um, we could play. Um, play what? Uh, I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. <laughs> but <gasps> run, 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 run. Okay. <laughs> um, back to Metal Gear Solid 2. I've been trying to say this, and you keep like keep getting sidetracked. Like I do with everything. So, uh... anyway, so it brought me like the variety of the like, video game. Like just it, what good game. it wasn't what I expected. Like the first boss, which is Olga. Mm -hmm. It it was like okay, so this is just a gunfight boss. That's pretty cool. I like spy movies. I love mm -hmm. and then it movies. ramps up so quick. Like the second boss of the game is as Fortune, but you can't actually beat her. Mm -hmm. And like you just like it just out of nowhere, you just shoot, and then all the bullets just miss. She's like Lady Luck from X Men. Except different. No, there. She had like Fortune has like her pat like she has a power because of the nano machines basically I guess, though. which is luck. The like, bullets just deflect off her basically. Like they ever like all bullets miss. It's you can different. never hit her. But then it just stops. Like there's no way to beat her. But then you get the Fat Man. Do you remember Fat Man? Yes. Freaking fat dude on roller skate skates drinking a margarita while planting bombs around a heliport or a helipad. Cool, dude. And you have to defuse the bombs and then shoot him. And it was so cool. Uh huh. It's so cool. It is. Then I then I get introduced to freaking Vamp, mm -hmm. which is one of my favorite Metal Gear Solid characters. Real, dude. Have you seen the fight? Four. What? He comes back in four. He does, and he fights Raiden, mm -hmm. the main character from two. Mm -hmm. And then Snake fights. Yeah, dude, you fight him so as cool. Snake. Solid Snake, that is. Old Snake. Solid Snake. Well, he's classified as Old Snake. It's Solid Snake. And I still need to finish Metal Gear Rising. I still haven't beaten that yet. I've beaten one, two, three. Actually, I haven't beaten one yet. I, I still, I'm, I'm just kind of, I got an. Uh, <laughs> Wait, what? What I have, games? Uh, I've beaten two, three, four. Uh, Metal Gear Solid. It. Yeah, I think that's all the Metal Gear games I've beaten. Okay. Still need to beat Rising. I still need to beat Five. I beat Ground Zeroes if that counts. Sure. So that's, Why not? So two, three, four, and uh, Ground two. Zeroes. Um, oh, I beat uh, Metal Gear, not the NES version, but the MSX version on the HD uh, collection and substance, basically, or subsist subsistence. Um, uh, Metal Gear Solid Three. But anyway. So, anyway, so we're uh, talking about Metal Gear. Snakes and Smash Bros. Why can't we have Leon? <laughs> I'm still on it. I have been on this since we tried to record Resident Evil 4 for the first time. Uh, a year and a half ago? Yeah, a year and a half ago. Yeah. Because it was like June of 2016. Uh, yeah, June of 2016, I believe, is when we tried to record Resident Evil 4 for the first time. Mm -hmm. And I loved it. I love that series. Hey, Hannigan. But we lost the footage. We were recording with, like, an old phone, like, microphone. Mm -hmm. Just sat it between us, and we just talked. And it was fun. It was great. What game? This. Oh, yeah. And then now we have microphones, like... Sound card adapters, cap like, a, ca like the same capture. Card. Shadow of the Claws. is a cool game. That was a good game. That was a good series. Nah, it's just a good game. That was a good series that we did on the channel of it. Oh yeah. You it's forgot we beat the game on the channel. It was a good game though. 
<laughs> Good job. Goodbye, lady. Bye. To your left. To your left. To your left. I know. Oh, that went straight through that. <laughs> um, that but Leon thing. would have like a great move set. Like, if they were allow, they if they were to allow a pistol in the game, you know. Think about it. Yeah, a real pistol. Yeah. Just a gun. Like it just comes with the game. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what that laugh hey, was. Hey kids, free guns. Um, but like it's rated E ten or up, of course. And think about it, Shadow the Hedgehog was rated E ten or up, <laughs> and he had a lot of guns, so it he did. wouldn't be Oop. too bad to have guns in uh in a uh, in a uh, yeah. You know, Smash Bros. Yeah. Like, his moveset, like, he could have a... Ooh. What do you think his moveset would be? Like, down B would be like a flash grenade or something like that, or incendiary. Like, his... Like, neutral B would be his pistol. Mm hmm Side B would be like a rocket launcher. I mean, launcher. they would probably do like, it based on uh, Resident Evil 4. Yeah. Since that's... The one that came like out. Like, recognized as the most popular one. With him, and it was it was originally a uh, GameCube exclusive when it first came out. Yes. <laughs> Closure of the church. church, church. Regarding the two fugitives, the ap apprehension of Luis is our top priority. The American agent, a distant second. What second. Luis stole from us is far more important than the girl. Unless we get it back, the girl will become useless to us. We must get it back to execute our plan to the end. If it gets in the wrong hands, the world will be become a totally different place than what Lord Sadler has envisioned. At all costs, we mustn't let that happen. Nevertheless, we're not letting go of the girl. To ensure that the agent does not get to her, I have locked the church door where the girl is being held. Anyone who needs access to the church must first get approval by Lord Sadler. You need approval by me, bitch. There is a key beyond the lake, but it should be safe now that the Del Lago has been awakened by our lord. No one will get across the lake alive. Plus, our same blood courses through the agent's veins. It'll just be a matter of time before he joins us. Once he does, there'll be no one else left that will come looking for the girl. See you guys next time. Why did you turn into a black man suddenly? I wasn't a black man, I was an announcer. Like a radio, like old 50s radio announcer. That's what you I was going You sound like you're kind of going into Cleveland or something. I don't know. That sounds don't like Don't do this. that, voice. <laughs> just don't do it. 